Pozo, the sack leader for the Red Blacks, one of the leaders in the Canadian Football League. Second and ten, Hamilton 51, and Evans with time loses the ball. This is something you were talking about. Malden, the ex Ticat, the sax leader, comes up with the ball. Lorenzo Malden coming off that edge around the corner. Dane Evans drops the ball a little bit. Lorenzo Malden times that reach to slap it out of there. And he makes his presence felt. There's a chance. No doubt. Trevor Harris shuffling forward. Hit. Ball nearly came out. He'll go down and get sacked. As Ottawa gets home on the quarterback, looks like Lorenzo Malden for his sixth of the season. And take a look here at Lorenzo Malden from his defensive end spot. What a great signing. He's been a little bit of inside information. On second down, three to the right. Pajardo looking that way. Under pressure again, taken down again. And that time it's Lorenzo Malden. The ex Ticat coming in, picking up the sack, and that is his. They weren't getting the big plays, interceptions, or sacks. They got two already tonight on Cody Pajard. Clock ticking down under two minutes now in a two score game. Well, there's a play fake, and they do take him down by uh, Malden, who gets another sack and celebrates that. But Left town. Education on the offensive line stacked up in the backfield. Lorenzo Malden. And come down hard inside. The moving of the hash marks allegedly to get the Z receiver involved, but I don't think it's about where the hash marks are. I think it's about where people's mindsets are. Oh Ethel Thompson taken down there. The sack leader for the Red Blacks. That's number seven for Lorenzo Malden. Second down and nine. Evans and Elks. First possession here on a Friday night in Ottawa. Cornelius is taken down. And look who it is. The sack leader for the Red Blacks. One of the leaders in the Canadian Football League. Stacked. The blood flowing early for the veteran quarterback as he hands it off inside and a tackle for loss immediately in the backfield that time is wrapped up and brought down. Two straight games for Mayala with a catch of 30 yards or more in the air. They go four receivers to the left of Harris. That's where he looks again, has to dance around. And the front four of the Ottawa Red Blacks. Lorenzo Malden in the opposing offensive backfield. Right, that's eerily similar to the drop he had <laughs> against Montreal earlier this year. Harris under pressure, squirts through a small hole but can't get away. It'll go down as a sack. Malden coming from the top of the line this time. Just two men rushing right now. Adams can't find anybody open and he is dropped. First of all, it is two men. One guy will spy Vernon Adams. In other words, he's going to stay at the line of scrimmage. Double Thompson, inside handoff here as it goes to A.J. Olet. Stacked up, Lorenzo Malden right in the heart of it. Ten sacks, and making plays in the backfield as well as we get a look at the Red Blacks starting defense. Second down and ten, four-man rush. Macbeth hangs in the pocket for too long. Down he goes, and there he is, Lozo, with his 11th sack of the season, leading the Canadian Football League. So they can't play certain coverages against him. Does it that time, but this time he falls down in the backfield, and will Lorenzo Malden get credit for another one? He scared him into going down. Much that meant to him, but you're right, this is the playoff game they're getting ready for now. Blitz coming! CFL with number 17 <laughs> padding his lead.